Hey guys, Clumsy here, and welcome back to Transport Fever. It's been a long time, I know. Sorry about that. But I just got back from my three-week trip. Not vacation, unfortunately, but yeah, still a trip. And so now I'm back, and now we can resume the videos. But yeah, thanks for uh, all the comments, and thank you for letting me know that you still like the series. Uh, we have a new game that came out, Mashinki. And a lot of you actually prefer this game still. And I totally understand that because uh, Machinki is still in its uh, infancy stages, if you could put it that way. So it's still in early access, a lot of things being developed. And Transport Fever is very mature. It's been like out for, what, more than a year? And so, and it's a beautiful game. So I understand why you are really interested in this TV still. So thank you very much for that. So, what happened in the previous episode? That's a good question. It's been so long that I forgot, but I think... I think we created... We upgraded these trains, right? <clears throat> the main line. So, let's do a little recap for everybody. Since you probably have not... Seen any video for, what, three? Three weeks? For Transport Fever? Or two weeks, maybe. Anyway. Yeah, so we have this main line coming from Wolfston. We're making this loop around Wolfston, Old Ash, um, what is this place? Springwell, and we have, <clears throat> we extended it. So initially all those three cities, and then we extended it crossing over the river to Springwell, I believe this is. Spring Wolf, rather. Yeah, over here, beautiful, lots of waiting passengers. And uh, we extended this line, an offshoot line that is flying over like so. I love that. And bending, curving over, eventually landing in uh, Clearden. And uh, we used the JR Japanese train for this. Yeah. That one with a beautiful sounding horn. Amazing. And uh, it's not earning money yet so far, but it's close. It's pretty close if you look at it. It's negative 500k. <laughs> Maybe we should uh, downgrade it a bit, but nah, it's, it's okay. It looks fine. And our main line is earning us 9 million. Actually, a while ago it's earning us like 12 million. So it, it fluctuates every now and then, but it's earning us a lot for sure. It's, but anyway, yeah. From uh, Spring Wolf, we extended it to uh, Lockwin and then finally to Summerhaven is where we stopped. Now, I did get some comments from you guys that you wanted to continue this line. So, you wanted actually to make a circle line here. So, the plan is let's continue with that. From Summerhaven, let's go on forward to Deep Castle here in the southern city of this northwest area. And then going back from Deep Castle, looping all the way through to Wolfston. And then we can have two lines of trains. One going clockwise, one going counterclockwise. Now, as some of you guys mentioned as well, that might not be too realistic. I mean, in, in, in that might be true for like MRT lines, but for trains, maybe not. But it looks kind of good. It looks good. So let's push through with it and it looks pretty nice. It's like an ideal scenario. So let's go with that and... Uh, see where we get to. Before we create any tracks though, let's uh, plop down a station here. Uh, let's go with the flying station again. An elevated train station. Two tracks, uh, 240 is what we used. Track layout, I want a slightly different track layout, but before anything else, let me change the roof. I like a simple roof, I don't like those fancy stuff. Uh, half roof is okay, and... Uh, <clears throat> the tracks, the track layout, I like this. Normally we use track layout 2, I think, where the both directions are inside, yeah, right next to each other, both tracks. Here, I want it end-to-end -end for a change, you know, so the, 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 the tracks will be splitting when they come to the, the station, which might be less optimized, but it's, it looks really good really good like a lot of MRT lines in here in Singapore have setups like that where the platform is in the middle so the tracks are in both ends and it's uh, much more friendly for the passengers at least All right so let me see we're coming from somewhere there uh, we're crossing over here I 
think that can work. Might be expensive. Ooh, what is that? It's the first time I've seen that train. I'll have to take a look what that is. Okay, let me plop this down. Hopefully that's the right direction. <clears throat> and let's have a look at the, the trains in here. Okay. Multiple units probably. That's the one. Stadler Flirt. Oh, okay. Didn't we have a Stadler Flirt already before? I don't remember the look anymore, but I remember we created these guys. Stadler Railer of Switzerland. Looks pretty good. When we get enough money. Right now, we're still not so rich. Maybe we're not, we're, when we're at billions, we can afford it. Because it's like 20 million each. Alright, so... With that... <clears throat> How do we create the track? One simple way would be to just drag things over. I don't think it will be very efficient though. So if we just drag it through. Mm, hello. Can I move? Okay, it's playing hard to get again. 28 million. You guys like that? Uh, let's, let's see. If I connect you there, that's 29.5 million. That's the easiest root straightest fastest but really expensive and i'm not sure if it's going to be worth it we could go and try and loop around or try and uh hmm, maybe i'm not sure which which one is causing the most cost which is really making it expensive if it's the the bridge going over the water of or if it's the bridge in general because theoretically we could like go down here and not be have a bridge here over land anymore and just rise up again when it's time to go and cross the, the water yeah so what i mean is we could follow that exact path but we go down so you see from here it's 13.2 if i try and elevate that it becomes 18.7 which is not really a huge jump, is it? Although it, it is, it's 5 million. So if from down to up like that, that's like 5 million right there. So we'll be able to save a lot if we try and uh, go down here. Yeah, I think, we, I think we can do that. I think we should do that. Right, so let me see. Let's try that. Is it okay here? Over here, we'll need to maintain the bridge because uh, we're crossing over water. I think that's fine. Or we could go and plan like that. Make the bridge as short as possible. Yeah, I think that can work. <laughs> Just checked it. To heck with it. Alright, and then from here, yeah, that's gonna be pretty cheap look at that hmm so that really saved us a lot of money actually might also need to dig through here yeah let's let's just dig through here actually that will make a tunnel hmm, that's fine because we don't want too many elevations because we want this to be as fast as possible and if we do the tracks little by little, we'll be able to save money, but it will cost us. That looks pretty anyway. It looks so nice having a tunnel there, like a bridge going down, tunnel going through. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. And that one is 12 million. <clears throat> yeah, that, this, this bit is really something that we cannot, we cannot extend so much. We cannot make cheap. Uh, should I bite the bullet? I'm wondering. Let's do it. <laughs> wow. Okay, fine. Alright, so that's one. And then if we connect this... Okay, it's much cheaper. That's, that's good. That's... Uh, that at least is good to see. And if we just copy everything... Yeah, it's, it's much cheaper. That's fine. Although here, <clears throat> the thing is, oh man, all right, that's gonna be disastrous. Okay, K 
Okay, we can probably stick through to there. And then branch off. Okay, there we go. Yeah, there we go. But that's like 7 million. What the heck? Ooh, if I just cross through here, that's 3 million. Maybe we can do it the other way. From here. Merge there. What is the closest thing that I can merge with you? Wow, these bridges are really tricky, huh? That one, I think. I can make it short since they're stopping anyway. Make it cheap. Can do it like that, right? Hmm. But it's not like they're snapping. Look at that. Look at the middle. The middle, they're not really joining up. So maybe I start from here and just try it out. All right, let's see. Just cross all the way there. Yeah, that looks pretty cheap. Look at that. 2.57M. And then if I branch through, branch out from here. Okay, that's more manageable. Okay. So it, it, it splits out here, which looks a bit weird, but fine. <laughs> okay, that, that's good. That's good. That costs a lot, though, but I'm going to make it worth it in the end. Beautiful bridge there. Nice view. Now, the thing is, how do we extend that all the way back to the city here? And we'll have to destroy these depots in order to connect to it. But yeah, it's going to be tricky, definitely. We'll have to probably cross over like that. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be tricky. Let's see, if we make that happen... Wow, we can actually make like a... That's interesting. Okay, that one is good. So we don't... We don't create an intersection at all. But that's going to be very expensive again. Yet again. Alright, let me see. Let me see what, what the game will do. If I just drag this over up to that point. 34 million, no way. I hope I don't accidentally press the check. <laughs> no way, sir. That's 33 million. Look at that. How many bridges and tunnels that makes. No way in heck. Alright, so what can we do? We can try and curve here, go around the city, and then maybe cross, make a bridge somewhere. Let's see. Like if I do it like this. Wow, it's going to make a tunnel, really? There, okay. Okay, so keep it level. Uh, it's going to be a bit slow, I know. Let's start from this side, because this is like the outer angle. So, we're sure the inner angle is safe. This one is what we need to focus on. Alright, so maybe we can make something like... Uh, like 150 maybe? 145 is okay. Yeah, that one is just straight through. Okay, we'll make a bridge in the middle, but it's not that big a deal. That's 459k. What I'm really worried about is that part here, because that seems like going off the cliff and then making a bridge. I wonder if we can make like a bridge all throughout. Uh, we'll see. Let's, let's see right now. Let's see right now. If I just drag this over, 119 million. You guys want that? <laughs> they don't even have enough money for it. What the heck? 72 million. You guys like that? That okay for you? <laughs> no freaking way. No freaking way. Yeah. <sighs> it goes against my cheapskate code. Alright, let's do something like this. Make something cheaper. Can we make a crossing here? I guess we can. Don't, we're not really using that, are we? 
<clears throat> but um, I'll have to destroy that part though. Because as you guys say, road over rail, not rail over road. Or something like that. You know what I mean. Okay, let's go with that. 612k. That's fine. Is it? Um, if we connect that, it's going to make a road. It's going to make an intersection, but it's fine. Because we're not going to use that anyway. Small. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. No issue. Um, not a road. I want a railroad. I want a track. Okay, so maybe I can go through like here. Like this small bit here. Is that possible? If I like make... Uh, thinking, thinking. If I make this, if I terraform this, make this a bit wider for two tracks to be... To... Uh, be even. Fresh strength high. For two tracks to make it across. Will that work? Not sure what I'm doing here. Okay, I think that works. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> okay, let's see. Check. Oh man, that's too much. It's too much. There it is. There it is. Cross over like that. Yeah, minimal terraforming. That's the way. That's the way I like it. Oh, and from here, it's gonna be like, Geronimo! <laughs> yeah, I think so. I think this might be a big boo-boo on my end. Yeah, look at that, 20 million. 25 million! What the heck? Ah, because it's so high. Yeah, not that's not gonna happen. That is no deal. Maybe we can come from this side now. Let me see. If I come from this side, whoa, new stuff. What is that? It's a tram and uh, a loco, I think. Even, Steven. Nine million. It's gonna be like 18 million. If I connect you guys, 73 million. Mm, maybe not. Okay, here is a good spot. So maybe we can come from here and then loop around, like from there. That's more manageable. That's still millions, but that's more manageable, I think. 17 million is... I think I like that better. 16.8. I think that's still good. So going down here... No, actually, it shouldn't go down. It should... Continue going up. Man, this is getting tricky, huh? This is getting really tricky. There, that, like that, maybe. 19.2. I have to cross over like that. That's what I want. Okay, let's, let's, let's begin here. Alright. Let's maintain that. I don't want that too. Okay, that looks good. All right, bridge working. Oh man, I hope I don't make a mistake of this. 18.8 million down the drain. Uh, fine. Let's see. Now how do we connect there, guys? Oh, that's it. That's just one million. Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely working with that. Although, if you look at the, the speed, I think we'll have to delete this. There. And then let's connect from there. This is like advanced track laying now. There we go. That's beautiful. Yeah. 
That is beautiful. That connects everything. Now what we need to do is get this next up. Um, how do we connect you? Is it possible to start here? Okay, I think it is. Yeah, this kind of track layout is very tricky, huh? Okay, that I think it likes. Okay, and then from here we connect out like so. Good. And this one we just copy. Okay, that's good. That's smooth from there. And it's not cheap, but it's working. Almost there. Not really, but you get it. And I think, I hope I did the right angle here. Okay, that doesn't work. That's not something I like to see. Okay, good. There we go. Are you connecting? Yes, you are. Good. And now we create the road again. Maybe back off a little. Wow. What's happening? Okay. That one works. And then that works. Okay. The little things in this game. But yeah, you can see how beautiful the tracks are being made. I mean, no, no other game comes close, I think. With how detailed it makes these tracks. The logic and the the realism it puts in beautiful look at that just a work of art that's just a work of art in itself wow all right so now we have this <clears throat> um i think let's stop this so the income was around 10 million let's see how that works uh we'll remove everything so uh we have eight stops how many stops do we have six stops so we remove everything from after the sixth stop because the seventh stop is going back. You can see here. So instead of going back, what we now do is we continue. So we add this as a stop and that one. And that's done. That's done. Yeah, that's a complete circle light right there. Look at that. Yes. Now the thing is we don't have signals yet. So we'll need to put in some signals manually. Um, but I think I should be able to make that pretty quickly. Uh, let's see, I, I need the... I need the thing here. There we go. Okay, how long would it be? It's a 240 meter train. I guess that should be okay. By the way, I, I tried to get my hands on uh, Train Sim World, but uh, no, I didn't, I didn't manage it, unfortunately. So no Train Simulator for us in the meantime. Sorry about that. Then again, those folks who are watching this series, I guess you're more interested in, interested in the train management in the creation of tracks rather than the driving of the actual trains, right? Or maybe both. Maybe you like both. I don't know. Yeah, I would have wanted to try it out. I would have wanted to learn how to, uh, how the the trains really work, how you actually drive them, and what are the things involved. What do you have to take into account, like the, the track layout, the, the when do you brake, you know, things like that. Because all those things would make me understand more how to make tracks, and that would overall help how I build tracks in this game. By the way, I found this mod. What is it called? Track layout, I think. It's pretty promising. I, haven't, I don't have it enabled because I tried it out. It was too complex for me though. It's, I, th I think it's from the same maker, and don't quote me on this. The same maker as the one for flying junctions. This one. Which can do the flying intersections for you like that, but it's um, it's too complicated for me. Too many options. Like 
I would need to study it more. Like you can see the number of options in here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and it's it gets pretty laggy, so I haven't really explored it yet. But yeah, in terms of functionality, in terms of yeah, in terms of uh, power, that mod seems to be pretty promising. Okay, uh, now what do we do? Let's place a signal right before the station as you guys taught me same as well here and uh, here let's just even it out I know my signals aren't even at all but this is like the shortcut method there are not too many trains yet so it's not that critical they're not so much in the risk of bumping in each, into each other. Okay, this is going to be tricky. Uh, that one, and have to flip the camera, I think. Where's the signal? Where's the signal? There it is. Under the trees. Oh, there it is. There we go. Okay. The next one, let's put outside just for easier placement. <laughs> Good. Yeah, like the sig signal's there. If I manage to play a train simulator, then I'll understand how to read the signals. And that might enable me to download and understand the the signals, the, the, the signal mods, like the, the mods which add more signals into the game, make it much more realistic. So many different types. Yeah, that can work. There we go. So how does it look now? Uh-huh. <clears throat> that is inverted, I think. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like that, though. Because this is crossing over there, and I'm not a fan of that. So my, maybe, I need to remove that? Oh, crap. Okay, that, that, that's not what I wanted. Mm. Alright, let's see. Where does it start? It starts here, here, it starts here, this crossing. And why does it... There. Okay, now, now it doesn't work at all. <laughs> okay, I don't, I don't know, I don't understand why. Let me try and trace it. So that one, okay, yeah, that's the correct direction. Yeah, this is the correct direction. I might have done a big boo there. Let me see here. So let's look at this line. Could not connect all stations because probably because of this one. Yeah, the, the locked stations here. Probably. Now it works? Yes, it works. Okay, good. Alright, so number one is Wolfstone. Let's see if this works. Uh -huh. <clears throat> and that is the wrong station right there i think yes because why are you in that lane now yeah that's the wrong one definitely um all right so what i'll do is i'll lock you to terminal one yeah and i can lock that but in old dash i'll say you have to Where's old dash? Okay, that's the right one. But it seems to be crossing there. Ah, I don't like that. That one. Remove that crossing. Is any other line using that? No, not really, huh? There we go. So... What's now? What now? Brown cow. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Lock you? Okay, there you go. Ah, yes, yes. Uh, it shouldn't have been two. It shouldn't have been one. It should have been two. There we go. That works. And then this one. Let's remove all those connections, actually. This one is the wrong way. I want it to be on the right. So, if we trace this... Um, and here, 
in old dash, I want you to be. Isn't this old dash? What is this? Yeah, it's old dash. So the blue line. If I say, yeah, I want you to be in terminal 3. Okay, that doesn't work. Why not? Wait a minute. Which one is terminal 3? 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, 3. 4 works. 4 works because... Uh... <laughs> okay, let's trace it. Four works because I start from there. If I wanted three, that should work as well, right? I mean, this they can use this second lane, second trap. What? Okay, let, let's let's trace it. There must be something wrong. This is the problem when you lock stations. Okay, number three, Springwell is. Where should we go? Springwell. I want to be here to there, okay? Yes? Is that correct? Let me review. Yeah, that's the one. Terminal 2. Spring Wolf. Let's verify that. Also Terminal 2. Yep. Here. I want to be in as well I guess yeah right and here summer haven also terminal 2 right and then here finally the castle terminal 1 okay that still doesn't work man am I so rusty at this game I just can't explain it anymore ah because I ah okay 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 Right, right, right. Yes, I understand now. It's because of this layout that we have. I need more platforms here. I need more platforms. Because I need this to be three tracks. Like so. And I need this to be... Right, okay, I get it now. I get it now. Okay, you connect there and you connect there good not yet but soon it will be Leave that and you connect here okay how does it look um no that's not what i want no, it is. It is. Okay, it is. Alright, good. Now it works. Perfect. Now the thing is, we have some trains who are stranded, I think. If you look at our vehicles, yeah, we have one train which is on the other side. Um, we'll have to provide a way for it to go back. Let's see. Where are you going? Yeah, see? It's up going the opposite way. So we'll have to do it like manually probably. Like that. Because it's still using the old uh, the old route reverse. Good. Okay. Now you're good. And then let's see, let's trace along the way there are any other problems okay happy all right let's see I hope I didn't destroy any other line okay where are my trains that one this one yeah this one reverse <laughs> and then Make a track there, temporary track, and you go. Now they're racing for each other. I hope they don't crash. Okay, good. 
And then we delete it. Alright. Happy. I hope I didn't destroy any signal. I don't think so. Okay, now it's moving. Good. Moving on. Mm, let's turn on our trains here. So we can trace it. Trace all our trains. That one is on the right direction, but wrong platform. Yes? Yeah, you are on the wrong platform. You're on the wrong side there. Go cross. There we go. Yeah, just a little bit of uh, hand holding. Need to guide them for a bit. And then maybe in the next episode is where we flesh out the other side. Right now we're doing the clockwise. We'll need to do the counterclockwise as well after a bit. Okay. Where are my trains? My trains are here. Okay, that's good. I do have a train here which is going the wrong way. So let's introduce a way for it to come back to the line. Do it. Thank you. <laughs> Manual adjustments. Good. Who else? Who else has a problem? That's good. And... Uh, we have a train here. Oh, I think this is the first time a train is using this path. Yeah, the newly created. Like I think the entire southern length here cost us around 100 million. Probably close to it, if not more. Good. Okay, I think it's good. What else? What else? Where else? Okay, good. I think we have it working now. <laughs> some of the passengers will uh, have some trouble understanding why their train suddenly turned around. Like, there was one train like here near Wolfston, and probably some passengers will want to go down there, and then suddenly, okay, you reverse, and you go all the way around, and then you drop off when you get here again. <laughs> It's probably going to be such a headache. Yeah, but it's fine. They'll get there eventually. Okay, and then let's have this play along. We're down to 6 million from 10 million, so we lost some money, but I think that will normalize as the, as the trains go and understand their new routes. Yes. And then we'll probably add more trains. Or uh, just transfer some of them to the other line. We'll see how it goes. It's pretty cool, huh? Right now we're... Yeah, some backlog has built up because we turned around some of the trains. But yeah, once they space themselves out again, that should be okay. We have one train here. But of course no one is going to go down here because we haven't really connected this yet. Should we do that now? Hmm. I guess let's do that and then let's call it an episode. Yeah? Right, so let's see. And where should I go? I could probably go around town. No, I can just go through here. No, no, let's, let's make this right. What is that? Taxi stand, okay. Medium street, let's close this off. Yeah, and let's close this off as well. Good. Alright, that looks good. So let's make a station here at the end. Um, what do we want? High capacity road station. Do we want like a, a pass through? Can we do that? Like pass through here? I remember I tried that before with this mod and it didn't work. 
and I kind of remember that I, I forgot to do something, I had to do something else for it to work, but I'll have to review it. If any of you guys remember, do let me know okay, how to enable this to be passed through. So what I want is like uh, left side street, new city, no no not, not new, not left, it's, it should be the top side street, new city, something like that, yeah, for it to be passed through. And then I think what I have to do is make it one way, was it? Let me see, terminal, just one. Uh, street type, medium. Maybe we can make it large. Yeah, something like that. And then we can say length. We can make it short, like so. The top side street, how do we say I want that to be big? Is there an option for it? Fence type, we can make it like steel or sound barrier. Tram terminals, don't really need that. Hmm. I can't remember how to do it. But let's plop it down and let's see how it works, okay? So let me delete this. Let me put that down in here. Don't need that large, too large thing. Maybe a medium should work. Uh, where is it? Street type, medium. Okay, that one should work. Alright, and then we can connect that here. That looks good. But I don't think anyone will be passing through here. That's the thing. So we can make you two stations. Uh, we can say old city, no, 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 that. New, new, new city. Length, one way two-way oh I think it's this one yeah I think it's this one one way or two-way all right let's try it let's try it uh, let me put some bus stops around and see how this goes bus stops here let's have a look at the the zoning uh, people will want to go let me see I can probably just traverse the middle for now. So from here, we can stop here in the middle. Stop here again, right after we cross. And then here maybe. Here. Go around like so. There. Where else? Here. And then go back. One more here. And then we're back. Alright, so if you trace that, and let's start with one line first. Look, we're losing money now on the train. Crap. No. Hang tight, guys. That's gonna work. Believe. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Now, he doesn't see, so you can see it, it, it makes, he loops around. What I think we should do is make this one way. There, that works. Yeah, that's how it works. But it's the opposite way though. It's the opposite way. Okay, so it can only be that way. Alright, let's, let's try that. do it okay can I not really do that okay I can't, I can't do that fine so it has to be this way three four five six seven eight nine ten yeah so it's like a pass-through station and then we can ha probably have one more which is something like uh, let me see maybe I can have it a bit length better length Length 2 probably would be fine. 1 is, seems to be too small. 
Okay, let me let me let me delete this. Make you length two. Fly. And then let's connect from there. Good. We good again? Yes, we're good again. Good. And then I think what we can do is to create another side. Like the same way. But flipped like this. One terminal, medium, top would be a new city. Yeah, it's the same thing. Length would be two though, and it should be one way. Yeah, that's a thing. It should be one way for it to work. And do it like that. Okay, how do we connect that? Oh, there we go. That works. It's not even. I don't think it will be even, but it's fine. Yeah? So this is one station, this is one station, and we can say add a new line, this time from here, and uh, going around all the way. I think that works. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Right? Perfect. Okay. That looks pretty nice actually. It's probably not realistic, but it's a nice variation, you know, to change things up a little. Okay, let's get the depot in here and uh, let's start this. Let's get this party started. Uh, maybe what I can do is I can just... Passenger... Hmm... Maybe a Volvo would be enough. Volvo 5000. Let's get three on each side. Yeah. Line one, color you yellow. Same yellow as that one. What shade is that? I don't know. Probably that one. And this shade you a bit differently. Green, probably that one. <coughs> Good. And in terms of name, what is this place called? Deep Castle. Yeah. Okay. So this one is. Oh, how do we name these things again? Bus, summer, okay. <coughs> Bus, the uh, direction is counterclockwise. This one is bus, the clockwise. Right? Yeah, should be good. There you go. That works. I'm not even sure if normal cars can go through here. Maybe not. Maybe that's an advantage, so it's like only a bus lane. Yeah, anyway, we'll see. Wow, we're actually really losing money here. Something wrong? Let's have a look at our vehicles. Oh, they're moving. Okay, yeah, they're, they're loading. Everyone seems to be full. But we're losing money. Yeah, everyone seems to be in the right direction. Yeah, so I don't I don't get it. I don't get it. That should be working pretty well. Oh crap. Alright, what is this? Oh, okay. Get you replaced by a Freightliner Cascadia, probably. Should, we should have that by now, yeah. Wait a minute, this should be food. Almost got. Yeah, to replace, go. There we go. All food? Yep. Okay, good. I didn't miss anything there. But yeah, uh, maybe this will even out later on. Okay, it's, I think it's improving. But that's gonna be a real bummer if we lose our main moneymaker. 
because we did that huge change. Um, we probably need the other line. We might need to split this. I don't know. Top speed is 130. Okay. This line as well. Uh, okay. Become freight liners. And uh, carry only con mats. Good. Auto replace. Go. Alright, so if you see anything that I missed, guys, why we're losing money here, let me know, okay? Maybe we need a different train, maybe we need the other direction, maybe that's what we're losing. But yeah, let me know. Let me know how we should do this. So far, though. Okay, at least this one has some passengers now. Although we don't service this part of the, the city, that's the problem, but it's a start, it's a start. Right? No stock trains, that's what's important. Yeah, we're good. Full trains, Let, let's have a look. How are you faring in terms of passengers? Are you going to unload all of them? Just a little. Okay, only unloaded a little. I think when we add the, the opposite side, this will balance things out. And this will uh, prevent our trains from always being full. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay, but yes, we are recovering. We are recovering. Yeah, so slowly the, the, the line is stabilizing and we're starting to balance it out. So we'll, let's see later how it goes. Oh, so let's sit for a while and I'll catch you guys in the next episode, right? Anyway, let's leave it there for now. Thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. It's a bit lengthy, but hopefully you like how it's going so far. And if you're not, let me know why. And if you do, let me know why as well. Anyway, this is going to be it for now. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like, give me a thumbs up, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And I'm looking forward to your comments. Thanks, and have a nice day, everyone. This is Taklamsi Geek signing off. See you in the next episode. Bye-bye.